Hello and welcome back to another Fortnite video. So as all of you may know and have noticed, the Hades chains were vaulted after not being in the game that long. But why were they? So at the start of the air bending event, they first just released skins in the item shop with water bending, and now all the bendings are in the game and are available to pick up around the map. And we noticed the Hades chain was removed, and a lot of people were like, "Why was it removed?" A lot of people are not using it. But there's very broken ability with the Hades chain. And I'm going to show you. As you see, this dash ability hits very hard. Doing 45 apiece, I think, for the main damage on the first two attacks. And then the final attack to finish off the combo right there does a lot more damage. Which making this thing really good. Also, the ability to pick up players and pull them, like knock teammates or whatever, makes this item very useful overall but why was it removed so a lot of people were using this item as i've seen in builds to try to retake people's walls but they also noticed something kind of unfamiliar here this item is still in tournaments which is kind of weird let me give you the rundown if you're hitting a wall you can actually hit players who are through said wall with the chains the chains don't stop at the wall the damage through structures kept going meaning that fortnite had to vault this item before players would have like an outbreak and get really mad because they were getting hit through walls blatantly. It's not even the people's fault who are using the chains. It's not hacks. It is just the item itself somehow was able to shoot through walls like that. And that's why it's vaulted. As I just mentioned though earlier, it is still in tournaments. And I've seen pros use this item along with SMGs to absolutely go crazy. I've also seen people start using water bending as their SMG. Because of the infinite ammunition and it no damage drop off. Making a lot of weird stuff happen. So, this item is still pretty useful in the game, even with the update of it being nerfed. So yeah, like I mentioned, damage, very interesting. I do think it will be added back to the game though, and probably shortly, I would imagine They've already fixed it, but are waiting for the next update to patch when they do another patch, which is probably here in like a week or two. It'll probably be re-added, and it might or might not be nerfed as far as damage. I don't feel like the damage is too overpowered, but it's definitely going to be added back. Tell me what I'll think of this little secret ability it had to damage through structures, and whether you think it was useful or not. I didn't personally get to take advantage of it until after. I did use it in a tournament just a little bit ago. Just, just experiment with it after watching a YouTube short on the through structure damage, which definitely makes it a lot more interesting. As y'all may know already by now, I'm going to be doing a V bucket giveaway when I hit 10k subs, so I'll have to do a register for that. It's hit that sub button. I'm also about to be streaming playing Fortnite with viewers. Any viewer can join. That's 100% free, so if you'd like to join and play Fortnite with me, we can run up squads, we can do creative, we can do this map. So yeah, just so to be a part of that. Thank you for watching this video. On the Hades chain, if you like to see more video content on patch updates and different nerfs, buffs, whatever, just subscribe. Thank you for watching the studio. Have a great day.